Okay. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, here's another mukbang. I'm sorry, I've been MIA for a while. It's not like I have a gazillion subscribers, but whatever. Anyway, I'm um, with, but we'll get into that as we go, because, you know, whatever. Probably not going to have much to talk about. But anyway, okay, so we decided to go to what place, Kim? To Dickie's Barbecue. Okay, so I guess, and we're going to... Okay, anyway. Okay, so here we go. Oh, let me explain something real quick on what we're having. Um... Get burger and some mac and cheese. So this is what it is. I'll open it up right now. And then oh wait, let me introduce you guys really fast. This is Kim. Hi guys. <laughs> so she's my sister-in-law. She's the person I'll be doing my mukbang with. And she got what did you get, Kim? Got some ribs. She got ribs a half and a rack with a side of mac and cheese, and it comes with a dinner roll. Or piece of bread yeah and then we got like um three different types of sauces i think it was like uh original original and then there was a sweet uh, and spicy sweet and and then a spicy one so there was three okay so okay let me just set up this camera you guys you guys have to be a little patient with me because this is like you know not something i do on the daily and as you can tell, I'm a little nervous. I haven't done a mukbang. I think I was a little bit um more loosened up on when I used to do my mukbangs in my car. But it's for 20 people. Okay. We just hit a bowl before we decided to eat. I should have said that. Anyway, so <laughs> this is what the the beef brisket looks like, you guys. Oh, okay. Well, I guess sit down the whole kid. <laughs> and it looks like it's just the buns and the beef like shredded beef that's why probably I'm kind of glad we got all the sauces so we can try them out okay so I kind of wanted to try the spicy sauce because it looks like it has like seeds in it okay which one's this one okay this is probably the sweet one the sweet sauce and the the original they kind of look the same so this is the one the red one the spicy one they're all red the spicy one is the only one that stands out because it has seeds. I don't know if you can, can see that. I am just spicy. dripping this shit everywhere. Anyways, so I actually did like a couple of mukbangs, but I never uploaded them because I didn't like how they, how they came out, I guess. And I looked like shit and it was like really late and then there was like the lady that, um, at the restaurant she kept coming so <laughs> it was like kind of awkward but okay it's cool so then I was like I told Kim let's do a mukbang and we were actually thinking about doing it on our way over here but I like traffic is just not the biz so I couldn't do it so anyways um what you want to talk about, Kim? So, what was your first mukbang like? When, what was it? What did you eat? I think we ate McDonald's. And it was in my car, and it was with Eddie. Mm -hmm. And that's my dog barking. Fuck. <sighs> anyway, um... I'm pouring some of this sauce, not pouring, I'm putting some of it, because it is kind of spicy, so. Okay guys, so these ribs are good, they're crispy, mm, they're a little too hard for my taste, I like them to be like really tender, really soft, you know, to be able to like just melt in your mouth when you bite it. The sweet sauce is really good, by the way. Dickies originally comes from Dallas. That's why I know Dickies about Dickies barbecue. That's why we went there. I'm from Irving, Texas originally, which is like literally like 10 minutes away from Dallas, Texas. Um, I tasted Dickies the first time with don't say anything, Myra. Is that good? <laughs> but yeah, guys. The ribs should be a little bit softer and more tender. I don't know why, but they're super hard. Like they've been sitting in the oven and 
baking. Do you want to taste one more? Mm. I'm good. I think I put too much of that sauce. I put a little bit, but that shit goes a long way. It's too spicy? Yeah, it is spicy. It's pretty good, though. I'm not going to lie. It's pretty good. Why don't you mix it with, like, the sweet one so it can, like, balance it out or something? I probably Did you will. put it on the whole sandwich? Yeah, but it's not a lot. Look at it. Oh, wow. It's really not a lot, you guys. Let me show you. Hopefully I don't drop any. No, you probably can't. This one has a shitload of it, but it's just in that little spot. But anyways, it's pretty good. It is. For a little basic ass sandwich, well, it looks pretty basic. Like, it's pretty good. And then the mac and cheese. I don't know. Damn it, I didn't. I don't think I showed you guys. But this is the mac and cheese. And um, it's pretty creamy. I like it. It's pretty good. It's not like... So... I just can't stop eating. I haven't had, had ribs since I was in Texas. That was like three years ago. Almost four. Anyway. So... What are you guys' New Year's resolution for this year, if you guys have any? I honestly gave up that shit like three years ago because I always fail. And it's always losing weight, and I fucking love food, so that's kind of hard to do. So, I'm pretty sure everyone's New Year's resolution is to lose weight. I don't think I did any this what year. What was your New Year's resolution, I didn't, I didn't have any this year. I'm fucking left-handed and I'm meeting with my right hand. I don't even know why. Don't worry, I'm probably looks like you're eating on your left hand. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna try this. Let me see. I think this is well. Which one's that one, Kim? The sweet. That's okay. Let me taste that one because. Okay, then this is the original. That one's hella sweet. Okay, the original sauce seems to be pretty good. So I'm going to throw some of that on my on my sandwich. And hopefully it'll, it'll calm that fucking spicy ass sauce down. Yeah. That's the original one. Why don't you try that one, you fucking weenie? I'm too sorry, it was too spicy. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll try it right now. Do you want to try some of the sandwich, Kim? We tried the meat, I tried huh? those before. Yeah, pretty good. Honestly, you guys, I think the one from Costco, that shit's fucking bomb as fuck. They throw a bunch of... Have you tried it? They have one. Like, and they put Costco to eat. Dude, that's a fucking spot. Like, when you're fucking balling on a budget, that's the place to go. True shit. If you guys... But um, they have some bomb ass fucking beef briskets there. And it's kind of like this one, but they put a sh gang of coleslaw. It's pretty good, you guys. You guys should try it. If you guys haven't tried it, try it. It's pretty good. And honestly, that's probably like the most expensive shit there. It's like four bucks. Seriously. Did this, Kim? Whoa. She fanced it up a little. We went from the car to this. We literally picked this up and where was it? Glendora. It was mm -hmm. Or San Dimas, one of those. No, I two. think it was San Dimas. Yeah. We picked it up in San Dimas and we literally waited all the way until we get got home just to, to freaking eat it and to do this for you guys. That's why it wasn't that. Maybe that's why it's a little hard, Kim, because. But I am disappointed because they are hard. And they're really, really dark too. They're, they usually should look more reddish, kind of. Pinkish. You think those they were just sitting there? I don't think so. I think nobody like really orders them, so maybe they've been sitting in the oven. Because it is the most expensive plate in the menu, the ribs. And they were done pretty fast. I just heard them chopping it up and that's it. Mm -hmm. Oven. For real? Mm -hmm. And the slower... That's why they're slow cooked. 
Good thing like you get free ice cream. And it's not that great. And the bread is all hard. Yeah. Literally hard. The sandwich is good. It's pretty simple. I think um, the Costco one is better. But this one's good. But it's really overpriced. And... Like I said, probably the only thing good thing about it is that you get free ice cream. <laughs> but it's not that great of an ice cream either. It's like it's like the one that they give you when you when you go to like the the Chinese buffet or something like that, or like hometown or something like that. And it's kind of like it's not milk they're using. I think it's water. <laughs> well, you know, powder so, milk. or powdered milk or something. Yeah, it's kind of like that, but whatever, it's cool. That's kind of cool that they do that. So. They weren't too perky for my taste. <laughs> Hitting. Feeling kind of cool. I think I was drinking too much soda and I... We're drinking soda, by the way. Maybe it's not the healthiest shit, but I mean, none of this shit is, so. <laughs> I always say that if you guys want to know about Kim or want to follow her on Instagram, I'll put her Instagram and Snapchat on the description box below. Mm -hmm. And as always, I always put mine. No creeps, please. Leaves me a comment, which... No one really does, but the few ones that I that I have on my videos, um, they're kind of, you know, they're a little off too. But I honestly find that a little flattering. Because, you know, at least they're honest. Or at least they seem honest. Just no one comes up to you and tells you shit like that. Which actually, as a matter of fact, yeah, they do. A quick little story. Um, I went to a job interview not so long ago. And... The dude that interviewed me, um, he followed me to my car when I was leaving. And he told me, oh, um, <laughs> I wanted to see, oh, is it the movie of Gigi Gorgeous? I don't know. I think it was just like... That's just going to be on section. YouTube Red. Really? Yeah. You have to pay you for it? You have to it? pay. I think you do. I don't know. But anyways, the dude just came up to my car and told me he thought he should tell me that I was pretty. That was weird. That should never, ever, ever happen to me. And then that same week, I went to another job interview. <clears throat> and the dude that interviewed me, he tried to give me 100 bucks. I mean... Wasting her time. You should. I told her you should have took him. He probably wanted Snatch a piece of that ass. shit and be like, and that wasn't, it wasn't gonna thanks happen. for wasting my time, dick. <laughs> and then just walk away with the fucking hundred dollar bill. No. You know what, after that shit, I was like, I ain't taking this fucking job. Did you like the mac and cheese? It was too cheesy. But it was good. <laughs> what were the other options? Did you get one of those little flyer things? I think they had smoked beans on it. And then they had some other things called um, potato casserole. Something like that. Um, there's our dogs jumping on the door because they want to come in. <laughs> Alright you guys I think we're gonna end the vlog The vlog I think I'm gonna end my video here Hope you guys enjoyed it And if you didn't well then I'm sorry <laughs> Um
um, I'll see you guys next time on my next mukbang. Bye.